Howdy, 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 my beautiful Aries. How are you doing, darling? My name is Simply Velka, and today I'm going to be getting into your weekly tarot reading for March 2022, Aries, all right? So if you enjoy this tarot reading today or you just enjoy my vibe, darling, be sure to let me know in the comments below which cards resonate, as well as be sure to give this video a like and subscribe, Aries, all right? So let's just jump right into your reading here today, see where the vibes are currently at, right? See how it is that you are doing, darling, how things manifest in Haney, all right? We have the Emperor Energy stepping forward to you, Aries, okay, girl. Oh, this card's flying <clears throat> as well as the five of swords here and then aries what we got cooking up for you for this third card three of pentacles here Ooh, <laughs> i like this energy a lot for you aries all right and then this moon energy is in the back of the deck here so for you aries y'all are in this place of shining honey can i say that y'all are in this place of shining it's almost as if something or someone inspired you aries to to for you to like push yourself even more it's very much so you'll show them energy right so maybe someone in your life maybe like a naysayer maybe like a hater or something aries like someone or something aries that like try to cause drama in your life or cause doubt or friction here through your pentacles here as well i want to be even be surprised aries if some of you guys had someone in your life showcase their true colors because i do get that for some of you guys maybe in the workplace um maybe you discover that you were there's some type of injustice there uh aries and then emperor energy you are starting to see more of your worth and realizing be like all right honey you were doubting me over here darling i'm gonna show you how it's done right that's what i get with this uh energy here and so i love this energy just because aries it showcases to me that y'all are not allowing these uh disappointments here that these other people were hoping to uh dismay you or discourage you or aries you're just like uh-uh like you ain't gonna like you know who you are Aries and you're just like you know what darling I'm gonna take that hater energy and I'm gonna make haterade out of it honey you're gonna sip it as you continue thriving right and so I feel like it caught you off guard as well with this moon energy I feel as if you were just like whoa like I thought you were supposed to be my friend you're supposed to be my support system over here and now you're coming at me like this you're coming at me in this wave where what have you here and so for you aries i hope y'all are having no problems just cutting it out and be like all right honey you want to doubt me honey there ain't no space you don't have any space for that type of low vibrational energy here right you have the four of cups coming in here girl yeah i feel as if this energy here whatever uh whatever uh is going on here aries like i feel like there's just like this main energy of just distracting it feels as if aries like you are continuing on and just minding your business honey right doing your best hustle just creating whatever it is that you're creating and just minding your business here and so this other energy for whatever the case is like it's even throwing me off aries because i don't really understand this and like this person's mindset here where it's like they see you thriving but for whatever the reason is aries they're like responding very negatively to it and i'm just like girl bye <laughs> like and so very much so like can i say jealous dare i say jealous here uh four of cups energy dare i say jealous yeah so it's almost as if like this other person here doesn't like how it is like it's very much so being like oh what's go this person is like oh like what's what makes aries so special like why is aries having all these good things happen to them like why like what makes aries deserving of this i deserve this more especially with this three of pentacles energy watch your back aries for those that are in the workplace that deal with other people watch your back don't be trusting people right now uh aries because someone is extremely jealous and i feel like at the first chance that they get they're gonna try to tear you down because here's the thing as the emperor energy here aries let's have just that real talk honey my regulars know this as well you can my regulars will vouch for me aries in the comments below i normally don't go into these drama narratives right i feel like we're bigger than that but there is like this glaringly obvious energy here it's like as you continue shining as you continue rising in your greatness here aries right the emperor gets a lot of haters right that's just natural like as you continue being successful you get haters as you continue um feeling more powerful in yourself you get haters naturally and so this someone is responding very negatively towards this because they feel like it should have been them they feel like this should have been them and so with that five of swords energy i just don't trust it man don't open up to energies especially in the workplace aries be watch your back all right even with people that you talk to um in your personal life right you can test the waters too honey all right you can just start talking you might have already noticed it where it's like you talk about or exciting about these plans that you want to make for yourself and then someone's just like not responding in the way that you would hope expect them to respond it's just like oh i thought you'd be happier for me like i feel like you're already noticing 
noticing like the body language, how they're talking, when you talk about just like the goodness that's starting to build up for yourself, what it is that you're investing into. Yeah, four of pentacles. Ride, ride in silence right now, Aries. All right, ride in silence right now. Don't tell other people what it is that you, what's going on with you, because I feel as if those like, and with that moon energy, it's gonna be someone that you wouldn't anticipate feeling the type of feelings that they have. Um, it's like you, you're going to be caught off guard by this person, being like, wow, like I thought you were uh, cheering for me here, because wheel of fortune coming in here. As you like, things are going to continue ramping up for you, Aries. Things are definitely gonna be continuing ramping up with that wheel of fortune here the wheels have already started turning all right and as this month progresses as people um just see you continuing to rise right you're going to be noticing like a lot of things starting to come easier to you um a lot of opportunities just coming in out of nowhere which i feel like will be a nice change of pace for some of you aries um yeah star energy Darling, if you've been having your mind, Aries, on um, getting that promotion, if you've been having your mind on uh, really obtaining towards like the star energy is like that wish being fulfilled for you. And it's like a big wish, right? So let me use an analogy. Like I always, as like a little kid, always wanted to have like a platform or like a voice, right? So I can make a change, make changes and what have you, right? That's what I always have wanted for myself, right? So the star energy for me would just be more public recognition so I could have a bigger voice to do what I wanted to do, right? And so whatever that is for you, the wheel of fortune coming in, things are ramping up. And so spirits letting you know as uh, as the blessings continue turning in, uh, coming in for you, uh, Aries, there's going to be a lot of jealous people. There's going to be a lot of haters. Um, I'm being shown an evil eye right now, Aries. So be careful. I'm not trying to instill fear into you. No one can, no one can curse you, Aries. No one can bring you and ruin your success down spiritually, like a hex or a curse, unless you allow that energy. They have no power unless you allow it. All right. So this is why you just don't want to like, don't talk about just riot in your successes in silence right now. Even if you want to share about it again, like this is going to be a period of time where you just want to be in silence right now because until this energy reveals itself this jealous energy here you just don't want to allow this energy to even uh put an evil eye on you or just what have you right to bring forth that misfortune here because things are ramping up like march for you is going to be a very successful month uh can i tell you that aries march for you is going to be a very successful month all right even if you're not feeling this energy right now what i what it is that i'm tapping into because you're just like man man velka i would love some of that star energy darling i would love some of that wheel of fortune honey but where is it right it's coming right the wheel of fortune it doesn't happen overnight but it's, it's starting to turn Turn. So prepare yourself, darling. Prepare yourself because I feel like if you entertain these energies or get frustrated because you're just like, hey, I thought you're supposed to be my friend. Why are you not supporting me, honey? If you get too distracted in the white noise and being upset by people not being a good support system to you, like they should be, right? Like a good friend should, like a good partner should, like, you know, coworkers, like naturally you would want people just to celebrate. And I can tell you from experience, uh, Aries, tell you from great experience, even now, like when people start seeing you succeed, when people start seeing you thrive, they're going to find any excuse possible, Aries, to try to play you down to try to make it seem as if like you are not doing the thing right putting instilling doubt in you because again i feel as if this outside energy here is trying to just distract you aries um so you're not able to fully obtain this beautiful energy coming in here right and so just be careful about it all right just be careful and put up you know wear some black tourmaline honey have keep a evil eye on you here because king of wands energy this is your energy aries this is wands is fire energy coming in here y'all are really going to be in your element again be anticipate like a lot of eyes are on you all right with that emperor energy uh aries with that um as well as that uh king of wands energies both of these energies are like you're being the leader in a place and like uh, people are looking up to you while you are breaking the mold while you are breaking generational curses while you are um being the figurehead the leader role in some facet and so naturally people who wish they were quite literally they just wish they were you really can i just say that aries let's just let's just let's call a spade a spade here this is an energy where it's like um they wish that was you're living the life you're getting things happening that other people wish that they could do other people wish that they had the courage that you had uh that have uh, aries to do what it is that you're doing other people wish that they have had um just the good things that are coming towards you here all right so be you're going to you have a lot of people paying attention to you at this time seven of pentacles coming in here be anticipating your harvests um coming in here 
stuff that you have invested into starting to gain fruition here. I get for those that put stuff out on social media or like a business or what have you here. It's like you've invested a lot of time and energy in nurturing this energy here. And maybe it was just like writing still for a while, right? You know, so let me just, again, use an analogy, right? Let's just say YouTube videos, right? You put out a bunch of YouTube videos. They weren't getting this too many views. Some TikToks, honey, they weren't getting too many views here, right? And then it's like, things start ramping up very quickly for you where it's just like you start from like maybe like 50 views or 100 views couple hundred views and it ramps up very quickly to that to like thousands right and so that's how it's going to be it's not going to be just like an overnight success but it ramps up like this is an energy where it ramps up so once you start noticing the good honey start paying attention to the outside signs because spirit is going to continuously guide you right um you have to just pay attention to like yeah, just pay attention to where spirit is trying to actively guide you because it's always going to get you closer to your destination of that star getting you to that wish being granted. All right, Aries, you have a lot of good things coming for you, but you got it like with all these good things, you got to naturally make sure that you are protecting yourself with all these new eyes that are going to be placing on top on you here Aries you're going to have to um zhuzh up your uh protective measures all right um you have the six of pentacles coming in here things balancing out this is yeah and this is under your four pentacles so things like the investments that you have put it into as that four pentacles Aries it's been like an empty bucket you feel as if it's been an empty bucket you put all this energy all this money all this water into this bucket and it's never filling up right and then it starts filling up in tenfold after the fact right you the uh, energy that you invested into the investments that you put it into it wasn't an immediate profit but in the long run darling it's going to be a big payout all right so let's see any final thought i actually don't feel like i feel like we flesh it out with tarot uh here aries so let's get some let's get uh three moon oracle cards how's that sound aries to wrap up this reading here for you today but honestly aries honey y'all have some fabulousness coming in for you aries this is i love this energy for you guys because i know i know i know i know i've been keeping up with you guys like my aries have just been going through it recently it's been like a lot of internal battles um a lot of shadow work a lot of shadow work a lot of internal healing and so during this healing process you haven't had like you haven't felt productive in the physical world but you've been very productive internally other people haven't seen it and so for other people that's probably what it is aries it's like people are not seeing the hard work that you're putting in uh in right now aries other people are they're going to see it as you having just having this given to you overnight success and all that when in reality aries only you know like the amount of work the amount of tear blood sweat and tears that you put into this to have this happen all right and so that's how i see your story being all right disseminating moon take time to breathe out here aries because I feel like a lot of you guys have been in survival mode. Y'all have been in survival mode for too long here. You have the waning moon. What is it that you need to release? Yeah, this is reminding me, uh, Aries. Some of y'all might know, Aries, but there's this thing. It's going to sound super random, but it's like when animals go through traumatic events, um, like being, you know, what have you, whatever the traumatic event is, like animals will shake off the trauma. All right. And that's kind of what I feel like for you guys. Y'all have been doing so much shadow work, so much healing, Aries, internally. Y'all need to like shake it. All right, so allow this to be a reminder for those that have just been doing a lot of internal healing but haven't. I don't want to say like burning Palo Santo or anything. I feel like you would benefit from like a singing bowl, like some vibrations, vibrations. Look up some bi binarial beats or something like that, Aries, to just shake it up. All right to shake it as off because you loosened all this muck in your energy here and you need to just shake it off and you'll be very pleasantly surprised by like how much more weightless you feel after the fact all right aries so this is obviously going to be a specific message for some full moon and eclipse conclusions are within reach y'all are closer to this wheel of fortune moment than you realize all right and so i feel like for you guys just allow this message to give you the spark that you need aries just to keep on uh going all right because your story is about to be changing in a beautiful way and people are going to just be so jealous of you Aries all right so that's the reading that I have for you Aries I love you so much darling hopefully this reading was helpful brought some clarity to you and I'll be connecting with you sometime in the near future Aries remember if you want to book a private reading with me my website's linked down below simply Velka dot com next to my social media is TikTok and Instagram both of those just being simply Velka as well Aries all right I love you so much darling bye Aries